up guys welcome back to the channel um, this video is specifically for just editing a photo that I took last year no yeah last year in 2018 not thinking right last year in 2018 I took this picture of my girlfriend and it's my absolute favorite picture still to this day and this is what it looked like um, when I took the photo it was on a nice sunny day um, trying to think how what we were doing we were just venturing and um, I just told her stay right there let me take this photo and I took this and when I edited it it looked like this um, it's just my best one yet I definitely got that framed and everything because it's literally my favorite photo so what we're going to do in this video is we're going to re-edit it and make it different and see what happens I can change or see what I can do from just being a year difference in my um editing skills that I have. I'm not no professional. I am not no like the best at it and stuff but I just want to bring you guys along and show you um, how I'm going to re-edit this photo and compare the two difference. So because that's my favorite shot so see if I can edit it a lot better and see if I like it better than my original. We'll see. So we're going to go here. This is uh, Lightroom CC and we are going to do some little curves. Just going down here, pull this back a little bit, bring it down, put it right there. Do saturation, do a little bit of warmth, maybe not that much. There we go. Alright, so it looked like that. No, it looks like that, but I want to bring. I'm gonna open up a uh, classic uh, Lightroom Classic CC. And this is where I put my presets in and stuff. And I use Peter McKinnon's presets um, so far. Um, I haven't used anybody else's yet, and I also want to create my own uh, down the road. So, but we're gonna use different preset. You can tell I used that one as my first photo and mess with it. But I want to go and use. Peter McKinnon's 2017 presets. Really hard to pick. Which one I really like. I don't want to do the same color as the last one. Alright, let's do Avatar. Let's try this one out. Try to mess with this tone curves. I was messing with some collar here. Now let's mess with the sharpening. Like I said guys, I am not no professional at this, so um, I just I just do, um, I just learn, learn as I go. So I'm not no, not no professional at this, so I only making this video basically to see the difference. And um, yeah, I was always told to um, put something out there. No matter what you got, just put it out there. Just do something. Here we are. And plus, back to, sorry, I need to get back to folk. But plus, I got new uh, equipment, new lights. Um, super excited for it. And this black sheet, 
I went to the store and paid like 12 bucks for this watch. Just to black it out and get it looking good in here. So, hopefully a little upgrade of my videos. Um, Far, loving it, loving it. Alright guys, so what it looked like before, and then what it looks like now. What do you guys think? It tastes pretty cool. Okay, pretty cool. So, um, I actually really like that a lot. I love it, I love it, I love it. That's what it looks like. You see the drippy, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get Pretty excited for how that turned out. Um, thank you for watching. Uh, hopefully, I can do another video. I got my birthday coming up, so I might film that. Also, um, yeah, just uh, chase your dream, guys. Just do what you gotta do to chase your dream. And I applaud you for it. And yes, it's going to put hard work and it's going to be a lot of sacrifices, but it's going to be worth it down the road. So please chase your dream. Don't let it go to waste. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.